uh, I got some professor telling me, oh, you're pretty smart for a woman. My name is Rei Qi and uh, I'm working as a supply chain manager at Hubs. I'm Athena and I work as a product management intern. I'm Artisa and I'm a product manager. Risa Andres and I am the first quality control woman intern. I'm Daphne Porto, I'm a backend software engineer at Hubs. You know, whenever you meet a person and they ask you, what do you do? And I say, I'm studying mechanical engineering. They're like, oh, you? You study mechanical engineering? Seems as a surprise to them, and I, just, I hate that. When I took over the supply chain manager role, and uh, actually when I had the first initial meeting with many of the suppliers, when they saw me and when they heard my voice, they all said, oh, you are such a young girl. It is sometimes easier to put your point across when you're louder, and that doesn't necessarily mean that you're right. Unfortunately, that is more common amongst men than women and I really would like it to go away because it just makes, makes it worse if you're, if you're pushed to do something that you don't feel comfortable doing, just to make your point. When I was uh, doing my master in biology, uh, I got some professor telling me, oh, you're pretty smart for a woman, and it was really painful. Hearing women out, a woman's voice can get drowned out by those around her. That just the encouragement and the support of men or other genders. The industry overall should encourage women to realize these are not the two industries just for men, but it's for everyone. I believe it's very important to embrace women representing their companies. That way, we younger women um, are going to feel motivated to join the industry. The more we speak up, the better it gets and we will reach a point where we're equal and we don't need to have women in tech, it's just tech. Going through my first interview ever and actually making it into the role, I was very, very proud of myself for making it. Uh, during my uh, previous job, I could become lead. It was a huge challenge to learn to lead and uh, put stuff out there, and it was nice. My proudest moment has been supporting my team members as much as I can, to be honest. Don't be afraid, uh, and don't be afraid to take challenges. No matter the gender, if you, if you like the field and go for it, believe in what you, you can give in to the industry, and just go for it. Keep persevering, you know, don't feel bad asking for help, just trust in your skills. I'm really proud of the women community at Hubs and whatever we've done to basically break the barrier as much as we can. And the more women leadership we have, the easier it's going to get because it's just better to have someone to look up to and where you can go next. And I think the most important thing is that we support each other no matter what. <laughs>